Hello everyone and welcome to a new vlog. It is 2023 and it's my first vlog of 2023 which is a little wild because it's been over two weeks but I had not been vlogging for a while now. I haven't even edited a lot of my vlogs back from November and December and I probably will be uploading them just because I did start this channel as like um kind of like a collection of all my memories that I can look back on so I, I kind of do like tend to make videos for myself and not just for viewers but um, yeah that is one reason why it is super super cold right now and when I say super super cold that's cold for India not really cold um, and I do sound really different um, because I had lost my voice last week I don't really what went down I did get like an infection and then I like went to work for a day and I got back home and my throat was horrible and I basically could not speak at all I lost my voice completely um, but I am like slowly getting my voice back it has been a really hoarse though and every time i try and speak a lot it just gets worse so i shouldn't really be talking a lot <laughs> but i just want to quickly talk about the book that i am reading so i did start this year off with only 12 goals to read this 12 goals 12 books as my reading goal this year the reason for that is just because i don't want to like pressure myself with any number um, so I thought I'll just give it like one book every month and if I read more that's completely fine But I didn't want to pressure myself just because last year I set a goal of 100 But then I ended up only like getting it back down to 66 because I Knew that I would only finish 66 at the end of the year because I was like done with 60 something so that's what I did and I feel that worked out for me because I was also doing a lot of other things besides you know reading I was watching a lot of movies TV shows and going out and stuff and I want to do all of that so I don't want to like pressure myself to read this year either but I did finish three books so far this year which is great because um, I have really enjoyed those like it's not a huge number um, I did finish one which was a Christmas book so I'm not going to talk about that but I read um, a book by Taylor Drink and Reads after that which was After I Do and I really did enjoy that one. I gave it four stars and then I started another book by Taylor Drink and Reads which is maybe in another life. Um, so this book is what I will be reading in this vlog um, and it is a book basically about this 29 year old girl her name is hannah and she basically doesn't know what to do with her life like obviously that is exactly how you feel every time in your tw you're in your 20s and i don't know what it is about 20s but i have been feeling that massively like i know that I i'm not like entirely clueless because there are things i can do but i just feel like i don't 
feel very strongly about anything so far like I uh, sometimes just don't you know want to do this job that I'm doing and I don't know what to do and it's just this whole like um, uncertainty about everything and I get really really annoyed about it but um, yeah I mean I still feel like I have enough time to figure things out but I also feel like it's too late and it's all of that um, but anyway coming back to the book um, so Hannah is uh back to her hometown she has been like living in a lot of different cities since she grew up and um she's back to her town she is not dating anybody but she does meet her ex-boyfriend in like a bar and she's also with her best friend gabby so this book is kind of divided into two parts into which she makes two different decisions one is to go back home with her ex-boyfriend um like you know basically hang out with him or go back uh, home with Gabby because she's staying with Gabby and it basically um, shows you the different um, you know events that occur after both of her decisions and that's very interesting as a plot so I want to see how this plays out and I am only 24 pages in so I still have a lot of reading to do to figure out she's right now um, you know just going to this bar so I feel like the chapter after this is where it's going to be split and I'm really interested to see how that goes but I'm gonna go now and read a bit have my tonic water I'm having tonic water in this even though it's a mug <laughs> and I'm just gonna relax and uh, get ready for bed it's really only eight but um, I'm feeling it also I have been having these delicious Pringles uh, this is a flavor that Gab got me it's hot and spicy and it is so good I am like more than halfway through it and I love it so I'm gonna snack on these have my tonic water and read and enjoy the night also honey got a bat today so she is so so cozy it's so cute Well, I'm going to get in bed and relax next to her. Honey. Honey, come. Honey, look here. Honey. Hi, honey. So it is Wednesday evening. It is 6, 17 p.m. or something. And, oh, 6, 14. Um, and I got back from home home i got back from work a while ago um and i just i'm going to take a shower now and i'm probably gonna upload a video because i edited one of the um vlogs from november um which i think i mentioned before and i n feel like it's like a horrible vlog because i'm just talking and it's only like 12 minutes of me just updating about some books and I feel like um, it's okay though I want to put it up just because I want to keep it for myself but I definitely do need to figure out a schedule of how and you know when I'm going to be vlogging because everything is super chaotic right now which makes me feel chaotic in my head so I really do need to plan it out I have like such an old planner on the wall so I need to update that I also need to add my calendar up on the wall and everything like that so that I feel a little organized and um, yeah that's the plan for this week I feel like my voice is still not back and I really hope I get it back soon because I hate this hoarseness and I just sound so weird to myself i don't know what it is um anyway um besides all of that i do want to sleep early today so i am going to try and get in bed and read some i did finish till i think like page 90 or something of the book um maybe in another life and so far it definitely does show you like the repercussions of her you know, making a certain choice in her life it, the chapters are alternatively 
divided into like one part where she chooses to you know stay back in the bar with her ex-boyfriend like you can see the decision that she made um you know have its consequences in like the third or fourth chapter itself where she has decided to do a particular thing and it's interesting but definitely a little dramatic because i don't think that would be very realistic but at the same time it's quite an entertaining read i really am enjoying reading books about women in their 20s because it's so relatable in a sense um and i am just enjoying that so i'm gonna read that later but for now i'm gonna just finish a few chores and i might even watch a vlog and that's the whole plan but i will update you with my reading um once i like get a little bit ahead in the book and besides that life has just been mundane um work's been fine like i feel like i was definitely not feeling the best yesterday um and today i have been like better though definitely painkillers have a lot to do with that because um yeah i just um have been relying on those to not you know feel as sick but definitely um hoping that I will feel a little normal again once um, I'm back in my routine or something. We'll see. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and do my work and I will see you whenever I do. another secret video but I'm still going to talk about it in this vlog as well. I'm on page 85 and a very uh, prestigious kind of businessman who is a regular guest at this hotel. Hello everyone, um, it is Thursday evening and I am just relaxing in bed. I had a shower a while ago um, and I'm watching a reading vlog and Honey's chilling with me as well and I said and so many times, I'm so sorry but yeah i'm so tired but tomorrow is friday which is kind of nice though it is gonna be a little hectic because we have sports day in school so um i mean it's not gonna be that hectic because um the sports day is only to like 12 o'clock which is mm, like so much better because after that we don't really have any classes to teach so um that's gonna be good uh, if you're new here, I am a teacher, so I do teach um, secondary school, and um, yeah, I feel like it is definitely a really tough job and very, very time consuming for me, and I get really, really tired and drained, which is one reason why my vlogs kind of, like I feel, um, start coming in less because I have just been so so caught up with work and then I just try to relax when I'm free and I mean vlogging is not exactly work to me but I still feel like it takes up a lot of time because of the whole editing that takes up um, time and I have like so many other videos I need to still edit for my baking channel as well um, which I need to do hopefully I'll find some time on the weekend I have so much cleaning to do as well i just feel like so overwhelmed right now because i have so many things to do all at once um but i'm just gonna ignore all of it and sit here in my bed and watch a vlog and then read um speaking of reading i am obviously still reading the same book because i didn't really read in the train because i'm super tired but i am planning to read now like in a bit so like i i guess i showed this to you i'm reading maybe in another life and i am now on page 104 which is great um i only have like 200 pages or so left to finish this and i feel like i can finish this by the weekend um or over the weekend though saturday is working for us so i'll have to see but i don't really plan to do anything on the weekend except for just relax at home get my chores done and all that because i feel like i just need that um and it's only like one night honestly that i get to take a leave take a leave 
and honestly it's just like one day of a holiday so yeah it's just gonna go by and fly by but the good thing next week is Thursday's holiday because it's Republic Day so that's gonna be great and I'm really looking forward to that week so now that I have all of that out of the way um, I'm just gonna get to chilling um, I do plan to take this vlog up until maybe Saturday or so and then end it hopefully I'll finish my book by then I will keep you updated but yeah, that is about it. I will see you um, whenever I do. Probably um, tomorrow evening or else on Saturday because I might just be tired tomorrow. We'll see. It is Sunday and I am clearly a little bit of a mess but um, I've not had a really good day to be very honest I have been feeling very low today and I don't know what it is um, I couldn't really figure why I'm feeling so low but I just do so I decided to take it slow and not really do anything um, and I have just been in my room just laying down um i am feeling slightly better now i am having a little bit of a diet coke um and i'm gonna try and clean a bit i didn't really um read anything which is fine um i'm not really feeling like reading right now i want to do something physical so i'm gonna sit down and try and reorganize two of my drawers so i have two drawers in my wardrobe there um which have like my jewelry and my eyeshadow palettes and i want to exchange them because i want to try and put my eyeshadow palette in the bigger drawer and then put all my jewelry in the smaller drawer um and hopefully that will be um a success because i don't know if it'll all fit in um and i thought i'll just watch a vlog and do that for now and try and just feel a bit better i don't really know what is like bugging me you know like when you feel really off but you don't know what it is that's exactly how i'm feeling but i will hopefully be feeling better later so i plan to shift my eye palettes from here to this bigger drawer um and as you can see i have so many palettes in here and these are like my small little mini eyeshadows i got from mars these are really really pretty and duochrome um i also have so many other palettes in here it's a little crazy but a lot of them are singles and then i have like a few palettes from like makeup revolution and like a lot of drugstore brands i feel are in here um along with a lot of indie brands and then just a few samples and stuff like that um yeah it's a little crazy also this one is really really pretty again this is by this brand called you can be and it's like a kaleidoscope like a highlighter palette but it's actually like really pretty to use as eyeshadow and you have like all these iridescent shades in here they're super pretty again some of my favorites are also the ones from glitter galaxy these singles are so so pretty and one of my favorites again the eyeshadows are all arranged and that looks much better. 
so it is Sunday sorry Monday evening it is 7 25 p.m. and I just remembered that I did not end out the vlog so I was going to vlog a lot on the weekend but the weekend just flew by like I said I did um, I don't know if I did tell you but I was working on Saturday so I only had a one-day weekend which was Sunday and I feel like I was just too tired and I kind of just was lazing around I was kind of feeling a little down yesterday but I'm feeling much better today I don't know if it was just like random or whether it was really something that I need to work on but um, you know I don't really like share a lot about my emotions and all that on here but definitely I have some horrible days sometimes where I just don't know why I'm feeling low but I just feel low and I could not really read or do anything because of that yesterday but I am feeling much better now and I'm gonna just sit back and edit in bed I have my computer here I'm just chilling in my bed and I'm editing and I'm gonna uh, end up this vlog here so that I can end up like edit this vlog as well later on Like I do have a few vlogs pending to edit from December, which is crazy, but yeah and I want to just put them out there just because I did vlog them So I don't want to just waste that and Then I'll be editing these and putting them up and I hope that they are sort of entertaining if nothing and a little helpful for any of you I feel like the purpose of vlogs is just to kind of calm like I see them as calming and just like knowing that everybody is living the same life as you and feeling the same things as you and all of that and that's why I really love vlogs and which is why I really want to keep doing them um, also just a little quick update on the book that I'm reading I did not finish the book but I am on page 161 so I am over 50% of the book but it will take me at least like two to three days to finish it if not more because I have not been like feeling like reading as much like I do definitely enjoy like I'm enjoying the book but um, I don't know if it's because it's split into two different storylines it definitely feels a little like disconnected at times like I want to know more about one story and then the other and like I I don't even know where the book is going really but I love the writing style definitely I love Taylor Jenkins Reid's writing and the way she you know writes her characters I am enjoying that quite a bit so I am definitely um, you know wanting to finish this and pick up another Taylor Jenkins Reid's book soon I do have um, One True Loves by her as well and I might like I might otter forever interrupted but i don't really know because that book is about like the uh, guy in the book like the girl she gets engaged to this guy and then uh her fiance ends up dying which is horrible like it sounds so depressing and i don't know if it's a good story to read while i'm already not really feeling the best so yeah not really something I'm that intrigued about but yeah uh, I'm gonna end this vlog out I might start a new vlog tonight or tomorrow um, depending on how I'm feeling this is gonna be a really nice week uh, because Thursday isn't off as it's the 26th of January so it's Republic Day so that feels really great um, which is why I'm really feeling a little good about this week but I might start a vlog tonight or tomorrow depending on how I'm feeling and besides that, um, there's nothing else to say. I hope you're having a wonderful day or night um, whenever you're watching this. And um, I'll see you soon in a new vlog. Stay safe and take care. Bye.